The Loch Ness Monster, often referred to simply as Nessie, is a legendary creature said to inhabit Loch Ness in Scotland. The first reported sighting of the creature dates back to the 7th century, but it gained widespread attention in 1933 when a photograph taken by a London gynecologist, Robert Kenneth Wilson, showed a large, serpentine creature with a long neck and small head. The photograph, which came to be known as the surgeon's photograph, was later revealed to be a hoax, but it sparked a renewed interest in the Loch Ness Monster and led to a number of expeditions and investigations in an attempt to find evidence of its existence. One of the most famous of these expeditions was led by Tim Dinsdale, a British aeronautical engineer, in 1960. Dinsdale filmed a creature that appeared to be a long-necked, humpbacked animal crossing the surface of the water. The film was analyzed by experts and was determined to be genuine, but the identity of the creature remains a mystery. Another famous investigation was led by a team from the Academy of Applied Science in the 1970s, which used underwater cameras, sonar equipment and other technology to search for the monster. The team captured a number of images and sounds that were believed to be the Loch Ness Monster, but none have been conclusively proven to be so. Despite the lack of concrete evidence, the legend of the Loch Ness Monster has continued to capture the imagination of people around the world. Some believe that the creature is a surviving plesiosaur, a marine reptile that went extinct around 65 million years ago. Others have suggested that it could be an undiscovered species of giant eel or even a giant sturgeon. However, the most likely explanation is that the sightings are misidentifications of known animals, such as otters, deer swimming, and logs. In conclusion, the Loch Ness Monster is one of the most enduring and well-known legends in history. While there is no scientific evidence to prove its existence, the continued sightings and reports of the creature continue to fascinate and intrigue people around the world. The Kraken is a legendary sea monster of Scandinavian folklore. Described as a giant octopus or squid, it is said to dwell off the coasts of Norway and Greenland, and was feared by sailors as it was said to attack ships and drag them underwater. The legend of the Kraken dates back to at least the 12th century and has been passed down through generations in the form of sailors' tales and folklore. The kraken was typically described as being massive in size, with tentacles that could reach up to 100 feet long and eyes as large as a man. The creature was said to have the ability to camouflage itself by changing color and texture to blend in with its surroundings, making it difficult to spot. It was also said to be able to create massive whirlpools and currents that would suck ships down to the depths of the ocean. Charybdis and Scylla are sea monsters from Greek mythology. They were said to dwell on opposite sides of the Strait of Messina, between the Italian mainland and the island of Sicily, and were considered to be two of the most dangerous obstacles for sailors passing through the area. Charybdis was said to be a giant whirlpool that would suck ships and sailors down into the depths of the sea, while Scylla was a six-headed monster that would snatch sailors from the decks of passing ships. According to the myth, sailors would have to choose between passing too close to Charybdis and risking being sucked down into the whirlpool, or passing too close to Scylla and risking being snatched by the monster. The Great Sea Serpent of New England is a legendary creature said to have been sighted off the coast of New England, specifically in the waters of Massachusetts, New Hampshire, and Maine. The first reported sightings of the creature date back to the 17th century and it has been described as a long, serpentine creature with a horse-like head and a long, undulating body. The creature was said to have been sighted by sailors and fishermen, who described it as being anywhere from 50 to over 100 feet in length. Some reported that it had a mane of hair or a crest on its head, and others described it as having a series of fins or humps along its back. The creature was said to move quickly through the water, leaving a large wake behind it, and was also said to be able to raise its head out of the water and emit a loud bellowing or roaring sound. The Cadborosaurus, also known as Caddy, is a legendary sea monster said to inhabit the Pacific Northwest, specifically the waters of British Columbia, Canada, and Washington State, USA. The first reported sightings of the creature date back to the early 1800s, and it has been described as a long, serpentine creature with a horse-like head, a long neck, and a series of humps or fins along its back. The creature was said to have been sighted by sailors and fishermen, who described it as being anywhere from 30 to over 100 feet in length. Some reported that it had a mane of hair or a crest on its head, and others described it as having a series of fins or humps along its back. The creature was said to move quickly through the water, leaving a large wake behind it, and was also said to be able to raise its head out of the water and emit a loud bellowing or roaring sound. The Storshadurette, also known as the Great Lake Monster, is a legendary creature said to inhabit the waters of Lake Storjone in Sweden. The first reported sightings of the creature date back to the 17th century, but it gained widespread attention in the early 20th century when a number of photographs and videos purporting to show the creature were taken. 
Valeriosauro, also known as the Lake Como monster, is a legendary creature said to inhabit the waters of Lake Como in Italy. The first reported sightings of the creature date back to the 19th century, but it gained widespread attention in the late 20th century when a number of photographs and videos purporting to show the creature were taken. The Sea Serpent of Gloucester is a legendary creature said to have been sighted off the coast of Gloucester, Massachusetts in the United States. The first reported sightings of the creature date back to the early 19th century, and it has been described as a long, serpentine creature with a horse-like head and a long, undulating body. Tatami Chan, also known as the Tatami Monster, is a legendary creature said to inhabit the waters of Japan. The creature is described as a sea serpent or dragon with a round head and a long, coiled body that is covered in tatami mat-like scales. It is said to be able to swim quickly through the water, leaving a large wake behind it, and to have a loud roar. The Ningen is a legendary creature said to inhabit the Antarctic waters. It is described as a large, humanoid creature with white skin and a number of physical features such as fins, gills and a tail. The creature is said to be anywhere from 20 to 100 feet in length. The first reported sightings of the Ningen date back to the early 20th century when Japanese and Russian Antarctic expeditions reported encountering the creature. However, most of the sightings are considered to be recent, with some coming from sailors, fishermen, and even researchers.